how to clean your clippers and get all the hair out of them without taking them apart to take them apart you can to clean them you simply undo that screw there the two heads slide off backwards and you can clean all the hairs from inside I won't do that for now I'll just show you the quick and easy way how to clean lubricate and um, sterilize your clippers all at the same time get yourself some medi clipper spray um, these are reasonably clean but I guarantee I'll still get something out of these uh, some dirt out of these place a tissue onto the counter or wherever you're working um, open your clippers turn your clippers on and simply spray down the end holding the clippers down and shake and as you can see that looked clean but just look at all the hurts just come out of that so repeat down the ends down the sides shake close the clippers repeat good spray on the blades themselves shake either side and this will clean all the hairs out of between the blades and lubricate them at the same time one last blast turn off simply wipe your counter simply wipe off done nice clean lubricated clippers there's still a bit coming out there but give it a couple of goes and it will clear it it's still not clear what you can do is unscrew this screw on the lever take it all the way out and as you can see in there it's not got it totally all out but if you wanted just to do a quick clean that would be the way to do it but um, to do it properly simply just take it off this does not affect your setting because the clipper setting zero um, zero gap is set with these two so this does not affect the setting so just simply brush out you could spray it as well if you wanted to well, let's give it a let's give it a full proper clean and service. Um, normally, there's um, a little bit of rubber in there in the in the in the, uh, the flexed ones, the ones with the cable. But this is a cordless, and this is actually the first time I've opened it apart. There's no rubber in, obviously needed in there, so that's just simply slides back on. Very simply oops there we go slides back on and make sure you put the little notch into where the notch goes there simply tighten up as tight as it will go without over tightening and that's fine you just check your gap your zero gap and that's fine okay 
Ciao for now.